Hang on, interwebs. Hey, can I call you right back? Okay, bye. Okay, so that wasn't a customer, never mind him. Hello, interwebs. Long time no see. I did just uh, tell my coworker I'd call him back. Hopefully it wasn't important. Um, so my car is finally fixed. It was crazy today. It was just like sunny and like 75 degrees outside. And I don't know if you can see it now, but I swear to God, it's about to like Wizard of Oz tornado outside. <laughs> it looks so bad. I laugh about that. It's really not funny with everything that's been going on with the weather. Oh, lightning, one, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000. There was the thunder. So what's that mean? It was four, four miles away. Did you learn that when you were in like third grade? I did. Um, Sorry I haven't vlogged in a while. My phone is still acting up, but it's at full charge right now, so I figured I'd give the vlogging a try. I actually have recorded three vlogs since the last time you saw me vlog that the audio was off, and it's just not fun to watch a video that looks like a bad Japanese dub job. That's right, dub job. Um, I was talking about something and I lost my track of thought. Oh, my car. So if all of you know, my car has been messed up for a while. It is fixed. It is fixed, but like two days ago I was driving and a rock kicked up and hit me in the windshield and totally cracked my windshield. Like it's probably a quarter of the way up the windshield right now. So it can't be repaired. I have to fully replace the windshield in my car. It's never gonna, oh, there was lightning again. It's never gonna pass inspection. I swear to you, it's so bad. Okay, so on the demo machines today we have, well, this isn't a machine, this is just TV. Moro Wind, which does go into like a, you know, cut screen or whatever. And then we have over here Tales of Vesperia, which unfortunately the demo has no like theatrical mode. So I'll probably switch that momentarily, even though I really want that game. I wish it was multiplayer though. Um, we have a lot of 360 games right now, including DJ Hero and Tony Hawk's Ride, both of which I heard were terrible. Um, I did a video yesterday about the patch, and it's funny because everybody's like, why are you doing a video about the patch? Because it's completely relevant, and not everybody watches all of my videos, and that's the realization of YouTube, is that a lot of the people who watch your videos aren't subscribed to you. So even though my hardcore subscribers may be sick of hearing about 4.1, there's a lot of people who watch my videos that didn't see any of my videos on 4.1. So if it feels redundant, I'm sorry. I tried to add some new added. I tried to add it. I tried. Oh, I just... I spit on you. That's so rude. You're, you're better now. Oh my god. Don't you hate it when people do that? When they're like, oh, you got something on your face. And you're like, ew, yes. Now I have your saliva on my face, you disgusting, disgusting person. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, ooh, there goes the cutscene in Morrowind. Look at it. It's a good one, too. I really like using Morrowind as the demo. Okay. All right. So I just got to turn the phone around and it said I'm at three minutes right now. So I don't want to talk you guys here off, but I will work on making sure that I charge my phone every day until I get my Sony bloggy, which honestly, the very latest I will have my new camera is after E3 because I'm staying with Gus and Shannon. And oh my gosh, and Cheska's going to be there too. I'm so excited. Oh, there's lightning again. I'm so excited about E3. It's disgusting. They just said yesterday in Kotaku that Nintendo's uh, new console will be, there'll be a playable model at E3. I mean, granted, um, a little peasant like me probably won't be able to play it, but I'm really excited to see it and hopefully they do some demonstrations. I'm really hoping it's not another gimmicky Nintendo console because, you know, I'm a Nintendo fan like everybody else, but the Wii, that was gimmicky. Not every single game needed motion control. A lot of the games would have been better without motion control. Just saying. And then the DSi and the DSi XL, I just thought those were weird fillers until the 3DS. They weren't like, oh my god, so much better than the DS Lite. It, like, I don't know. I don't know about that. Like, let's add a camera and make it more expensive and take out backwards compatibility. Like, that's how I felt about it. And I'm sorry if you have a DSi and love it. I don't have one. So maybe, maybe I'm missing out on a big phenomenon. And then the 3DS, don't get me wrong. I have mad love for the 3DS. But again, they didn't really, they just, I get that it's 3D. I get that. But I played the 3D on my friends. It hurts my eyes. I, I just thought I was going to go. Okay. I'm gonna go now for real. E3, I'm excited about it. My birthday is June 7th. Um, 
this is this is a weird question, but I have to ask you because the people who watch my vlog channel are like my homies. You guys are like, I don't know, always so nice to me and I love you and I appreciate it so much. Should I get a P.O. box? Um, a lot of people have asked me, can I send you something? And I'm starting to get leery about giving my home address. <laughs> Someone's going to like show up and be like, hi. And be like, uh, could you leave now? Um, anyway, so sh is that something that I should get? Because I don't want to be like, can you guys send me stuff? Because it's not like that. But I've gotten increasingly more messages about can I send you something? Yeah, and I'm not talking about like gifts, just like, you know, a letter or a postcard from somewhere, whatever. Just whatever should I get one because if I if, if you think it's stupid I'm not gonna do it but like if you're like oh my god I've got I've had this I, I don't know just let me know okay I'm gonna go now for real for the fourth time I love you all you're in my heart I'll see you soon bye